Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this tutorial, we'll be learning how to download from Google Drive, how to download better from Google Drive actually. So um, Google Drive actually limits you from downloading more than 2 gig. You can download more than 2 gig, don't get me wrong, but if you're downloading a file or anything above 2 gig from your Google Drive, it, it will be split into 2 gig. Take for example, you are downloading a 10 gig file. Your 10 gig file will be split into 5 2 gigs. Um, I, I hope that makes sense. It will be split into 2 gigs in 5 places. I think that's much better. So it will be split into 2, gig in, in, 2 gigs in 5 places. Alright, so um, this method will actually help you download everything um, without zip. It will help you download straight right on your computer. So it is for computer and not for mobile devices. I should have said this earlier on. It's for computer and not for mobile devices. All right. So first off, you need to get, you need to download um, Google Drive on your laptop on your on, on your computer. So I've downloaded mine already. Mine is installed already. So I assume you've already downloaded and installed yours. Then you sign in into your Google Drive. I mean. Google Drive application, Drive PC. Let's see. Okay, yeah, this is it. So, this is it. You need to download Google Drive from from here and install. Then, then you sign in on your computer. You just see download Drive for desktop. You, you need to download this and, and install it. All right. So let's assume you've downloaded that and you you've installed and you signed in. Now, all you need to do is click on the folder or the file you are trying to download right click on it you should see this bunch of options so um this video is a continuation of the previous video i actually made if you want to download from udemy paid free paid udemy courses so this is the continuation all right so all you need to do is add a shortcut to drive that's first then I might just pick my drive. I made a temporary folder for this tutorial. So I'll, this is it. AAA Udemy courses. Please note the name AAA Udemy courses. So I'll just add shortcut to that. As you can see, adding shortcut in some seconds, it should be added already. Alright, so it's already added as as you can see. Now that the shortcut has, has been added to your Google Drive, all you need to do is navigate to your file explorer. You, you navigate to your file explorer as you can see I have two Google Drive two um accounts signed in on my computer as you can see. So here is what I'm using for the purpose of this tutorial. So we'll, we'll double click on that into your drive and here is the shortcuts we copied uh here is the folder we copied our shortcut in, into so we double click on that and as you can see here is our, our, our folder so this is a shortcut as you can see here this is a shortcut if you download if you click on this and try to copy this to your computer you copy a shortcut the size is four kilobytes as you can see so all you need to do is enter into that folder you be re, you be redirected to the the um the folder on on the person's drive remotely i don't know if that makes sense but you can access it so all you need to do is control a that's to select all inside the folder you copy and take for example um i want to move it to um um i don't know, I don't know. all right let's make this of desktop i want to move it to my desktop new folder take for example i want to move it here so i'll just create a new folder i'll, I'll just call it um all right then i'm just going to paste then your download should start automatically the download should start automatically. The reason for this process is um, when you are making use of Google Drive directly, when you are downloading directly from Google Drive, 
whenever your internet is out, your download never resumes. That is just one down thing about Google Drive. But with this method, even if your internet is down, it will just bring a pop up that um, there's an error, sort of blah 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 blah. Hope you understand. Then, when your internet is back, you can just continue and it would resume from where it stopped rather than starting all over again which is so painful i mean take for example your download is at probably 78 or 98 you understand and one way or the other your internet goes off and you restored back your internet and you're trying to resume back your download it will just start over that's from google drive i hope that makes sense that's from google drive but when you are making use of this method it will download directly on your computer and whenever the internet goes off you can resume back your download uh, my internet is pretty slow i don't know why my internet is pretty slow but on a normal day you should get your full bandwidth so as as you can see the file size of this paid course is 3.94 gig if you have to download from drive itself it will split it into 2 gig a 2 gig file and a 1.9 gig file i hope that makes sense so all right guys thanks for watching my tutorial that'll be all for this tutorial if you find this tutorial helpful please consider hitting the subscribe button like the video and also share the video turn on post notification so you can get to know whenever i upload new content all right guys thank you and i'll see you guys in my next video peace out